Today we're electro fishing with Haunton, trying to capture white bass, pre-spawn white bass, to put into Washoe Lake and Little Washoe Lake um, that recently filled back up and was pretty void of fish. We're trying to rebuild that fishery. And Mahaton has a good um, population of white bass, and so we've just been out all morning cruising the shoreline, electro fishing, trying to capture some. So it's a it's a boat. It uh, puts an electrical charge into the water. Typically, shocks about 20 to 30 feet out from the boat. Um, fish that get hit, they kind of roll towards the surface, or you'll just see them swimming slowly, and we're able to capture them and put them in a live well. Or if it's not the species we're after, we just turn them loose. It only takes them 10 to 15 seconds to recover once they're out of the electricity. So do you still process the other fish? Yeah, so just, you know, so we know the health of the fish, all the species we're catching. We, we want to know, you know, if, if one species is not doing well, you know, we need to figure out why. But everything we saw today, all the fish we saw were healthy, fat. Um, they all look good so so what we saw today was a, a kind of a mix of the species that are in the haunt and we had um, we started with wipers we got some in several different size ranges from 12 inches up to about I don't know, 29 inches or so which was a pretty big fish that, those bigger fish were about 17 pounds the smaller ones are about two pounds the big wipers were nice to see it's it's good those fish have, are long-lived and they're, they're the ones that have made it through the drought and now they're enjoying the benefits of the good habitat that we have this year with all the, the high reservoir levels has flooded a lot of willows and cottonwoods and allowed a lot of forage base for those bigger fish to thrive and so in consequence they're thriving also. We got a total between white bass and wipers today we got probably about 30 total. Um, it was slower but you know they're all pre-spawn which means that if those fish meet up in Washoe Lake and spawn they can produce a thousand little ones. 